स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल एओ सेवा क्लासेस बाय डॉक्टर शालिनी उपाध्याय टुडेज टॉपिक व्हिच आई एम गोइंग टू टीच यू इज द रीमन टीमन रिएक्शन दैट इज द ओवरऑल रिएक्शन ऑफ द रीमन टीमन रिएक्शन आई थिंक यू ऑल स्टूडेंट्स आर डूइंग वेरी वेल इन योर लाइफ एंड सेफ एंड हेल्दी इन योर होम सो स्टे सेफ स्टे इन होम ओके एंड फॉलो ऑल द कोविड-19 रूल्स so it starts today's topic riemann timon reaction this is called riemann timon reaction or somebody called also riemann timon reaction as you is what you pronounce this so the riemann timon reaction is a chemical reaction used for the ortho formylation of phenols means ortho formylation of phenols is happen in the riemann timon reaction this is the simple example being the conversion of phenol to salicylic in this reaction phenol converted into the salicylic means the final product in the case of the riemann timon reaction is the salicylic the reaction was discovered by karl riemer and ferdinand timon okay this is the discover of the this reaction riemann timon reaction on the name of the scientist this reaction is called riemann timon reaction this is the overall reaction of the riemann timon what is this benzene ring and oh is connected here means this is the phenol and this one is the what chloroform chcl3 in the presence of what aqueous naoh means base phenol reacts with chloroform in the presence of aqueous naoh what forms this intermediate compound is formed means benzene ring connected with o minus na plus and here in on the ortho position chcl2 is here connected with this ortho carbon here nos in the presence of nos this converted into the what benzene ring connected with o minus na plus and ch2 this is aldehyde this chcl2 converted in the presence of nos in what ch2 in the presence of h plus this o minus converted into oh means what this is oh and this na plus remove here and this cho is connected here as here okay means oh in benzene ring on the ortho position there is cho what is the compound salicylic in the case of phenol ortho position is cho that compound is known as what salicylic okay so now we are discussing here the mechanism of this riemann timon reaction this is chcl3 means chloroform in the presence of oh minus or or minus what oh react with this h removal of the h2o happened if or minus is here then roh is formed and removed here after the elimination of water or roh what is formed this c minus cl3 or c cl3 minus is formed in this case this is a very unstable and the minus cl means chloride cl minus is removed here means cl what this bond breaking in where in the form of the cl minus means lone pair of this bond is comes to with cl this is chloride ion what is formed c cl and ccl and one lone pair is here if carbon connected with two bonds and one lone pair that means carbene is formed okay means here dichlorocarbon because two chlorine is attached here okay dichlorocarbon is the reactive here okay this is act as what electrophile why this is act as electrophile because this is the electron deficient species why this is electron deficient species because c bonded with cl and this c bond is cl means two electron two electron and two electron total six electron in the case of this carbon but octet completion two electrons needed here means this carbon is electron deficient species so this is act as a electrophile and the well known the all carbenes are act as a electrophile okay this is also one resonating structure of the phenoxide ion means phenol is act as a acid everyone know phenol is an acid after the removal of the h plus this o minus formed and 
after the removal of the, this O minus formed, and the, here is the CCl2, which is which is attack on this negative ion, and what is formed after this attacking of this negative ion? C. This CCl2 acts as a electrophile, and this O minus comes here, means double bonded created here, and this double bond shifted here, means their negative ion, and on this negative ion, this uh, chlorocarbene, means dichlorocarbene, act as an electrophile, and which attack on this center. Or you can say this negative electron, means this negative ion, uh, attack on this dichlorocarbene, means bonded here, okay, then this is negative charge. This negative charge is unstable, so, this bond, this H bond with this carbon breaks here and this double bond breaks here and this H plus comes to this carbon. Okay, then what will be formed? This bond here means O negative is here and this bond here means double bond formed here and this H comes where? This, come, this H comes here on this carbon. What is formed? This CHCl2 is formed. Okay, this is a very stable compound and in the presence of 2OS, this 2Cl is removed and this oxygen is bonded here. See, this is the isolated one. What is formed here? This CHCl2 changes into, converted into what? This CHO. Okay, means aldehyde. This CHCl2 changes into aldehyde. This O minus is as it is, is O minus. This 2Cl removed here. Okay. And S2 is also removed here. This is formed in the presence of S plus means an acid. Okay. S plus is in this because this uh, phenol removed uh, their S plus. Okay. This H again comes here and form what? This H plus comes on this oxygen means OH is formed. See what is formed here? This is OH. On this ortho CHO, you can also say this aldehyde position ortho on this OH. Okay, both are ortho to each other. Okay, on ortho position to each other. This is what this is salicylic dehyde. This salicylic dehyde is formed, and the Riemann Timer reaction is all over ended. Okay, I think I am clearing my point. If you want, then quick revise here. Who gave the Riemann Timer reaction? Carl Reimer and Ferdinand gave this reaction. Ferdinand Timon. Okay. On both scientists name this reaction named. Okay. The Riemann Timon reaction is called reaction used for the orthoformylation. Formylation. Okay. This is what? This is chloroform. Okay. Orthoformylation means here CHO addition after CHCl2 is converted into the CHO. Okay. The final product name is what? The final product name is the sesterdehyde. And the starting material is what? The starting material is the phenol. In which presence? In the presence of base aqueous NOH with the what? Chloroform. Okay. What is the intermediate? This is the intermediate compound. And what is the final compound? This is the final compound. And this is the overall mechanism of the Reimer Timon reaction. What is the reactive species here? Which one is the electrophile in the case of Reimer Timon reaction? Dichlorocarbene is the as a act as an what electrophile? Which is the electron deficient species in the case of Reimer Timon reaction? Dichlorocarbene is the electron deficient species in the case of the Reimer Timon reaction. Okay, and this is the final product OSCHO, and this is the mechanism which I cleared, which I discussed earlier okay thank you so much students have a very bright future if you like my videos please like my videos if you like my content then please like my videos and if you want more videos from my channel please subscribe my channel and press bell icon for it have a very good day students if you have any query you can ask in comment section i am also always waiting for your queries and for your emails so uh, go on and give me comments uh, what do you understand what do you not understand and uh, take care take care of your family take care of your health take care of your nature thank you students have a very very bright future and subscribe my channel and press bell icon for it have a very good day and have a very very bright future students